Good afternoon, everyone. Um, the Holy Spirit led me to uh, read this. I got this new book, and I'll tell you what, it is fabulous. It's Prayers That Rout Demons and Break Curses by John Eckhart. So, you know, I feed the birds and stuff. You know, I, I like seeing the bird, you know, watching all that, but. So I was reading, reading in here, prayers that rout demons <clears throat> and destroying the enemy's forces. So I'm just going to read this prayer about dealing with spirit birds. In the name of Jesus, I'm reading this. I bind and rebuke any unclean and hateful birds set against my life by the enemy in the name of Jesus. I exercise my dominion over the unclean fowl of the air in the name of Jesus. Let every spirit bird sent against me be taken in the snare. I bind and rebuke every spiritual vulture in the name of Jesus. I bind the operation of the screech owl, night monster, from op operating against me in the name of Jesus. I bind and rebuke the cormanent, the vomit, vomiting pelican, from operating against my life in the name of Jesus. I bind and rebuke the bittern for operating against my life in the name of Jesus. I bind and rebuke any raven sent against my life in the name of Jesus. I bind and rebuke any demonic eagle and hawk sent against my life and I command their nest to be destroyed in the name of Jesus. I pray these unclean birds would be caged in the name of Jesus. I bind and rebuke any unclean bird that would attempt to nest in my life in the name of Jesus. Let every wandering bird be cast out of its nest in the name of Jesus. Let your presence drive every unclean bird away from my life. Let every fowl of heaven operating against my life be consumed in the name of Jesus. Let the birds flee and fly away at your rebuke. Let me walk in the path of wisdom that no fowl knows. I will not be afraid of the terror by night, and I rebuke every night bird that would attempt to visit me at night. I am not a, I am not a companion to owls. So be it. But what I really like about this is if you look, um, every single line of the prayer is scripture. It's all scripture set up in, uh, in prayers. So it's powerful. You know, this is the word of God in these prayers, every single word here. So I just wanted to, I'm going to be reading more of these prayers. I'm hearing, you know, deliverance from lions. There's a, uh, you know, look in the beginning. Sorry, it's kind of hard one handed here. Just to give you some examples, but plugging into the power source, you know. Prayers for blessing and favor, prayers for revelation, prayers concerning the heavens, prayers for enlargement and increase, renunciations, prayers in Christ, kingdom prayers and decrees, prayers releasing the fire of God, prayers to command morning, the day, and the night, releasing the sword of the Lord, releasing the arrows of the Lord, breaking curses and casting out generational spirits, disannulling ungodly covenants preparing to engage the enemy so this is for uh i guess a question for my subscribers if there is a certain deliverance that you think that you need uh and you want me to read something i mean this thing covers a lot of stuff you know i mean to healing to all kinds of things just let me know uh in the comment section and if it's not in this book, I'll get one that has it or, you know, we'll make one up and we'll, I'll do a video and I'll pray, I'll pray that uh, deliverance prayer for you. So, I'll let you guys go and hope you're having a great day. So, talk to you later. See you, love you, bye.